Welcome back Marvel fans. Today I have another Marvel Select figure and this one features the Incredible Hulk. This was the only figure that I picked up at Megacon 2010 just last weekend. But yeah, it's an older figure but I had to get him when I saw him because I thought he was amazing looking. He's really huge and when I take him out of the package I'll show you the size comparison with Thanos. I'm a little sick so that might be why I sound a little different. But yeah, let's take a look at the back of the box. So here we have the back of the box here. It uh, shows Incredible Hawk on his stand and gives a, a little bio right there. And there's also Captain America and Iron Man figures below. Here's a closer look at the Incredible Hawk in this packaging. You can tell from right even in the box, uh, there's a lot of great paint job there and you could tell that he's got worn out uh, creases in his muscles and it's just an awesome looking figure and this Incredible Hulk is one mean guy. So let's open him up and let's check him out. So here we have Incredible Hulk out of his packaging. You can tell this figure is just plain huge. Basically the feet just mold right in there. There are some pegs there so he can stand you know more securely but it's pretty good. And then yeah. To get a real good size comparison, I have Thanos, which I will break him out in a little bit after I show the articulation. But, yeah, this figure is just, just incredible. If you look at the detail here, I mean, those joints are just huge. And that's just one mean looking mug. You can see the back detail there. All right, let's take the look. Let's take a look at the articulation. So here we have the Incredible Hulk up close and personal, and let's take a look at the articulation on this huge figure. It actually does have really good uh, articulation. Let's take a look. There's a big, huge ball joint in the shoulder. His head spins around all the way. Keep it up there. There's also a big ball joint in the elbow see that and his hand spins all the way around there is this there is waist articulation there's a ball joint in the hip pivots all the way around and pivots in and out there's a big Every joint on there is huge, but he's got a pretty big knee joint there. And he's got articulation on the foot right there. So yeah, the Incredible Hulk is just a really wonderful figure. Has great articulation, and I highly recommend him. And before I go, let's take a look at Thanos. Now that we have Thanos out here, you can tell the size comparison that the Incredible Hulk is quite larger than Thanos. And Thanos is a pretty big figure. So yeah, this Incredible Hulk is just just amazing how huge he is. It's very um, comic accurate for the size. Um, and before I go, I want to show you the War Machine from Iron Man 2 series. And you can see the size comparison there. Can you find the War Machine? This Incredible Hulk is like two times taller than the War Machine. So yeah, we're talking about a huge figure here. I highly recommend the Marvel Select figures, they're just awesome, they have great articulation, they have great paint jobs, everything is just wonderful. Also the Iron Man 2 series line is awesome, even though they're smaller figures, they're, they're awesome figures. So thanks for watching my review, check it out, thanks for watching my review, check out my other videos, and still a couple more days in the RC giveaway, so watch that, and look at my Megacon videos, those are amazing. So take it easy guys.